side. And the back line of the Soul Infernal is torn limb from limb. Yeah, the Nano is just so huge there. I mean, even like an Immortality Field, you would have been with a Tracer there, be able to burn through You can through just that. stick around. Yeah, and yeah. stick around, right? Just be sturdy. That's where I think, like, if you're Soul, right? Like, what value are you getting out of that Baptiste? Like, the Immortality Field is really about it. Like, Ant Matrix here with this type of setup isn't contributing a lot. It's hard to heal Mag, although he's pretty self-sufficient when it comes to the mobility to get him the health packs he needs. We have EMPs online for both teams here. Eventually, Sol has to make the gambit. It's going to be Hyundai from the high ground here with the Ant Matrix. Has to throw an Immortality Field down instantly. He would have loved to have used that on his tanks in the fight, but instead it's forced. Skewed fights Pelican, though. He never had a chance to EMP. Perhaps he was just holding on to it. Either way, the Infernal are forced to part with their ultimates in order to get back into the game. Oh, I mean, that was clean there uh, from Zest. And I think there, you see the power of the ball comps, right? Where. Uh, you no, know, some damage comes in there from Zess. Is uh, that'll be the uh, Outlaws getting to 98. Some damage comes in Mag with a pile driver there over the top on the shoe, and there's nothing he can do. Where Bernard has a little bit more defensive capabilities, right? A little bit more potential to you know, peel defense matrix to the back line, then go in. It's really all in on offense here for the Infernal. The Outlaws just need one good fight, and Pelican has an inkling of how it might start. Hanjay spotted there. Pelican wants a bit of that Baptiste, and he'll have it! To the high ground he goes. There's a sense of Bernard maybe knew where the summer was headed, but he couldn't do anything about it. Now to the point, skewed, riddled with bullets. Mag trying to trade back here, but it's going to be a rally in play for Violet. Now his shield bash is out of the way. Mag must get out. And, and the Inferno will have to regroup here, Mag. But Zest! Flattened by the micro rockets! It is a point flip, but you have Mag still in the mix. Oh, you lose. For how much longer, Matt? Yeah, it looks like you do have MN3 coming off a of spawn, but this is not going to last for long. Houston Outlaws here may see skewed attempt to contest, but no chance. He would have jumped to MN3 if he wasn't already dead and buried. Uh, it is a very close competitive map number one. With the rally in play, it's Fearless down. Violet now trying to assess the situation. He'll back up. Yeah, and you have to wait here if you're the Soul Infernal. You just had... I know Mag and Zest, they're alive towards the end. It's now you're getting everybody off a of spawn, but look at this Pelican lurking on the supports. Still holding that EMP from the last fight. Still two minutes to play here, so the Outlaws winning here would be great, but it's more that needs to be done. It's Zest ushering slowly the card forward. Mag in the back line slept here. There might be an opening for Houston. Zest again, testing the payload. Mag's able to get away. Oh! Oh my word! Pelican, nothing you do about that one! And Matrix on the high ground and the shots from MN3 are good! That's another! <laughs> Happy is down! Only a body shot required there and now the Primal Rage Winston comes to collect! Skewed here looking at Violet, wants to push the bring off the cart here, but Fearless is having his way with your team! He'll chase Skewed down now as well, Zest having to find Shu, but that's not going to be enough here, the EMP finally comes out! Man, I feel and like... a sigh of relief from Fearless there. Can't blame the man. I feel like those are fights you got to win, though. I mean, if you're going to get to the high ground, invest the Ant Matrix, and then MN3 is just going to turn around the corner, just, you know, just take out two players, and then, I mean, what? They have to, <laughs> you know, you had to, uh, you know, Mag was slept, he got out, right? Like, everything was going right there for Soul Infernal, and, and they had to invest that Primal and the Nano up to the high ground to get him out of the way. But I feel like if you start off a fight that well, you got to win it. Max starting to realize he needs just a little bit more than this disruption. This Discord has been sowing. Hasn't converted into solid, consistent team fight wins for the Infernal. And they're running out of gas. Well, this allows Mag to play a little bit more static on the objective, right? Not like they don't really need him kind of rolling around, displacing. They really need him to force fights on the objective, Matt, which that allows them to live. They've got to get there first, though. Look at how, look at how slowly the Infernal are approaching this. Mag eventually will get there, yes. Well, they have no speed, and they also have a few targets who are easily diveable. So as soon as they see that they're split, they're going to attack. Scoop was out of the fight for a while there. Violet has rallied. Fearless to the high ground now, and Skewed has an opportunity to blow this right over. It's the Captain Sun getting launched here, but the shield instantly thrown up. Where does he fire this? He doesn't know. Happy looks like he's affected by it in the back line, but it has to be an outburst to get Skewed to safety. Now the pressure on Mag mounts. It's immense. It's happy to find Hanjay. That's the Baptiste out of the picture. Fearless, he wants more. The man is hungry and won't be denied. It's MN3 chewed up, spit out, and boot off the map. Now it's Zest to fall, and the Houston Outlaws will stand strong on Blizzard World. The Outlaws just take care of business there.
taking map number two. Is Probably on the mag. You're looking at you, you've been able to punish mag with some sleeps, but not able to finish him off. You don't have a true answer to the MN3 flank anymore. Sombra probably not it. Minefield here looking for Happy. He's having to step away. Nobody's more than happy to stand and fight. The hack on Mag. This is dangerous. Fearless also punishing him here. This should be the Outlaws. Able to move back in. Yeah, I mean, you lost uh, in MN3. Is, uh, we're going to have a brief Moira switch. It would look like maybe they'll just make it back. But it seems like they're going to concede. So not going to make that switch on back as you lose Skewed here towards the end. So this is going to allow the Outlaws to build up some more. But it was, I believe that was actually Shu at the start who was actually able to take out MN3. Uh, be able to pick up that kill, you know, Ana versus uh, Soldier, where now they actually have the Orisa in play. So it seems like now that when they see the Sombra on one side, they go straight to the Orisa to be able to live. Okay. Zest doesn't quite get what he came for there. Hyunjae hacked up. This dive with the Sombra looking effective now. Where is Mag in all of this? Ignored, not in position. No, it looked like Mag was like kind of like wrapping around and maybe go through like the arches in the middle. And then they just get the, the nano. Stagger. They get the nano on the fearless and they just send him on the oh, stagger would be horrible. This here. is it. It's all infernal now. Have one chance. EMP. And it's gotta be here. EMP, you're totally okay allowing to give up space here if you're the outlaws. Get this EMP off. Probably EMP bio and then in a fearless. Sanjay! Scoots! They're all down! The last time you'll hear their names this weekend! The Outlaws move back in here, and we're into overtime. Who could touch? It'll be Zest, the only player. He gets there for a moment. There's a Lucio on the way. Hanjay wants to keep his team in this one desperately. He's hacked on the way through. Zest punched away. Overtime kept going for just a little longer, but it's just the dregs of the Soul Infernal. <laughs> Nothing but passion that keeps them running here. Mag trundling through the doorway, it's going to be skewed as well. And then 3 is brought down by Happy, who back away. Mag with a terror search now, sacks him on in! Shoo! Gets out, Bionade on himself just so he can escape. The spear doesn't quite connect and Violet brings him down. The Outlaws don't just ride with the wind.